In the context of branding, a fab icon is an icon for your web application. The show up on the browser as icon for the tabs and also when people save these URLs in their bookmarks, these applications can then be identified with their unique fab icon. Let's see how we can use them in our systems to give you your applications a unique branding. So this is my service studio. I have a reactive web application that has a customer entity with these attributes. I have dragged and dropped them to my main flow to create the usual customer listing and detail screen. And then I publish the application. How does it look? Let me launch it. So I basically have the customer listing and details page. What where the fab icon comes into play is the icon that you see on the browser here. You can see there's a our systems logo there that is being appearing. Now, in case for your applications you want to change it, you can go back to your service studio, switch to data tab, and look for a folder called resources. This one. If you expand it, you will find that there's a picture called fiveicon.png. Select it, you can see a preview of the image. To replace it with some custom fab icon, you just have to right click on it, click on change resource and pick the custom picture that you want. For example, this flower in my case. You can also make a see the preview of the picture in case it's correctly loading. If it's, everything is okay, just go ahead and publish the application. You must republish the application so that your changes are on the server. And then with that change, if we go ahead and launch the application again, we should see the fab icon. It takes a while, just wait there. These things are cached at the browser. So make sure you clear the cache as well as a good test would be to open the browser in incognito window. So let me close the other tabs, give it a refresh. And you can see now here, the flower icon is appearing and that's how you use custom file icon in our systems thanks for watching